Hi, I'm Steve Drake and we're here at Drake's Restaurant and I'm just cooking a really lovely dish using uh, meantime Indian Pale Ale uh, and we're going to cook some chicory with it. I want a really nice hot pan for chicory to get it really, really sort of start browning it and uh, put it in this way up, so cut side up and then we're going to season it in the pan and we're going to let all the seasoning just fall into the grooves. So this is when we add some beer. Now this beer has got um, a nice bit of bitterness on the back of the tongue and it's quite, you know, it can be quite strong, you know, like on, on its own, like with, with food at least. So we've got to be quite delicate with it. So we're going to add a little bit of beer, not too much, but we, this is going to emphasise the bitterness. We're going to boil off the alcohol. We don't want to eat raw alcohol, it's not pleasant. Just get that to a rapid boil. We're going to add a little touch of orange juice as well. Just freshly squeezed orange, just a little bit. Nice rapid boil, I'm going to get that in the oven. The chicory is going to take about three three minutes just in the oven there, just, just cooking really nice and gently. It's going to take on that lovely flavour of the beer and the orange juice and touch. Uh, so the other, other ingredients we've got, um, pickled peaches. So we've just made a little pickling syrup from distilled vinegar and sugar. So if you look at the chicory, the chicory is... If I taste that now, and it's really interesting how your palate works, and I can taste chicory but I can also taste the beer and it's kind of flicking from one to the other and it's really quite exciting. So I'm just going to put that on the stove to reduce it and to glaze it now. If we cook it more and more, the juice will just keep coming out and then it will end up going sort of quite soggy and mushy. So we want to cook it quite quickly. There's no liquid left now. All, all ready to go. If I turn it over, it's, oh, it, looks, yeah, it looks absolutely wonderful, I think. And I love, I, lo I love these grooves you get in it. I think they look amazing. Okay, so our little garnish with this is Pickled peaches, which we've spoken about, where um, our raw, raw chicory. Again, just adding texture and flavour all the time. And then we have our ham. And this again, we're seasoning the dish with some salt now. This is like, it's got a lovely saltiness to it. And then I'm going to just put on the uh, poppy seeds, which are going to add a nice nuttiness to it. Uh, beautiful chervil flavour next. So this is an aniseed flavour, of course. And again, you could use sweet Sicily, we could use tarragon, we could even use dill. So we're just going to tear it over and just let it fall on top. We've got our peach vinaigrette. We don't want the dish to taste of peach and ham and no chicory. So we've got to be careful how much we put on. And then finally, just to finish it off, a bit of fat's quite nice. A bit of fat, a bit of Gruyere cheese. Okay, that's it. So we've got chicory braised in meantime Indian pale ale with pickled peaches, Monmouthshire ham and chervil.